Hello everyone, I'm Tamara McClure, Product Manager for Graco's Oil and Natural Gas Division. And today I'm going to be talking about our pneumatically operated chemical pumps for chemical injection. So let's give a product overview of the Python series pumps, starting with the Pythons. The Pythons use a timing valve design to regulate the air, comes in three air motor sizes, requires a minimum of 50 PSI inlet pressure to operate and can achieve a maximum flow rate of 169 gallons per day and can operate in pressures up to 12,000 PSI. The Python XL uses a slightly different method of regulating the air. It uses a Mercur air valve or Mercur air motor. And that air motor only requires a minimum of 15 PSI inlet pressure on most models, comes in three air motor sizes, and can achieve a maximum flow rate of 370 gallons per day with a max operating pressure of 12,000 PSI. The Python XL DA. These pumps utilize the same Mercur air motor for regulating air, except it uses a double acting pump which doubles the flow when compared to a single acting pump of its class. It's also self-priming, so in the event that you need to prime your pump, you don't need to physically be there at the pump. And if you get any air trapped in your pump lower, it'll automatically or naturally purge itself of any air. These pumps come with a one inch pump stroke and can achieve a maximum flow rate of 700 gallons per day with a max operating pressure of 7,000 PSI. The Python XL DA25 is a product line extension of the Python XL DA. So it's also double acting and self priming, but comes with a two and a half inch pump stroke. This helps achieve a max flow rate of 16, 11 gallons per day and can operate in pressures up to 10,000 PSI. The Python and Python XL are single acting pump lowers or uses single acting pump lowers where the Python XL DA and DA25 utilize a double acting pump lower. Now let's take a look at the breakdown of the Python pump. Starting with the packing nut, the packing nut can easily be accessed by sliding over the dust cover and this is where you'll gain access to the packing nut and be able to adjust it if additional sealing is required. The timing valve is what regulates the air to the Python. It uses a shuttle valve design, which is very efficient and keeps a consistent cycle rate on your pump. The one thing to remember is that the timing valve is independent of back pressure. So if you get a spike in well pressure, that's not going to affect your cycle rate. It'll still maintain a consistent cycle rate. This timing valve has a patent design on it currently, and as mentioned previously, requires a minimum of 50 PSI inlet pressure to operate. The precision stroke adjust can be found on top of the pump, and it ranges between a quarter inch all the way up to one inch. There are mark indicators on the stroke, underneath the stroke adjust feature that gives you markers for quarter inch, sorry, quarter stroke, half stroke, and full stroke. Pump lowers are 316 stainless steel, come in seven different plunger sizes, five different seal materials, and the plungers can come Chromex or ceramic coated. Pump lowers are equipped or come ready with Graco's check valves, and we make it very easy to disassemble to gain access to the seals. Python pumps are both CE and ATEX approved. Python XL uses a Mercur air motor or an air valve for regulating the air, comes in seven different plunger sizes and three different air motors, requires a minimum of 15 PSI to operate, and can achieve a maximum flow rate of 390 gallons per day with the max pressure capability of 12,000 PSI. So let's take a look at the Python XL. The Python XL uses an air valve, and the air valve is dependent on back pressure. This means if your back pressure changes, it will change the speed of your pump. The speed of your pump is controlled by a needle valve. The needle valve actually controls the back pressure to your pump. So in the event that you get any change in well pressure, you can adjust the needle valve to compensate for that. Air valve requires a minimum of 15 PSI to operate, so these pumps work really well for applications operating off a low well gas pressure. 
The pump stroke are three position stroke adjustments. The lowers are 316 stainless steel and come with either Chromex or ceramic coated rods. Mercur, Mercur air motor is proven air motor technology that's been out in the market for 11 plus years that is utilized and utilized on several other Graco products. Utilizes a low gas consumption for increased efficiency. And as mentioned before, only requires a minimum of 15 PSI to operate. Adjustable packing seals, just like the ones we have in the, in the, in the Python pumps. So let's take a closer look at the seal design used on these single acting pumps. So that's going to be the Python and Python Excel. They're adjustable seal stack and uses a Z-lip design. Same design used on most CIP pumps. Comes in five different seal materials, Viton, Una, Viton Extreme, CalRes, and Aflas. Next, let's take a look at the Python Excel DA or the double acting pumps. This, these pumps utilize the same Merkur air motor used on the Python Excel, except they are mated with a double acting pump lower. So the double acting pump lower is gonna pump fluid or chemical in both directions of the stroke doubling your flow when compared to a single acting pump. It's also utilized for providing continuous flow operation for better pump efficiencies. The pump lowers are also self-priming, so you don't physically need to be present at the pump to prime your pump, and in the event that you get any air trapped in the pump, it will automatically purge itself of any air. We make it very easy to service with minimal tools required, and these pumps are envi environmentally friendly, um, on the four and a half inch air motor options, there is an available gas recovery add-on kit that you can buy. So let's take a closer look at the double acting pump lower. This is a cutaway of the pump of the pump lower. You can see that it uses adjustable packing seals. It uses similar Papa style check valves, except they are internal to the pump lower. You'll notice that the plunger rod is hollow through the center, and that's how you achieve continuous flow on the up and down stroke of the pump. They're self-priming and double acting, so you're going to double the flow, and again, it'll prime itself in the, in the event that it needs priming. The Python XL DA25 is a product line extension of the Python XL DA, except it uses a 2.5 inch stroke instead of a 1 inch. This will allow you to achieve maximum flow rate of 1,600 gallons per day, or around 6,100 liters per day. It comes in two air motor sizes, a six and a half and a seven and a, and a, a six inch and a seven and a half, two plunger sizes, three quarter inch and one inch, and three seal materials. And it comes CE and ATEX approved. Some key product features and benefits of the Python XL DA. Because, it's a half, because it comes with a two and a half inch pump stroke, it's two and a half times the flow compared to a Python XL DA. It also has minimal parts compared to the comp competitive, competitor pump. It's self-priming, self priming, which makes it very easy during setup. And you have the ability to recover your pump in the event that you have any fluid loss. The Python XL DA and DA25 our vertical design, so they mount vertically, which will help you reduce fo footprint. And in areas where space is at a premium, just like an offshore rig, these pumps are suited well for those applications. These pumps come offshore ready, so they're in their guard coated to withstand any marine environment and salt environment. And come, all models come with a recover recoverable exhaust gas add-on kit. Which is, which is an option, it's a kit that you'd have to purchase separate. You can find additional information and resources on our website at www.graco.com. You will also gain access to JEDI, where distributors can interface with the Graco platform. You can also find us on social media and LinkedIn, and a lot of great information on Salesbook and additional online training on Graco University, and you can always contact our customer support and tech, technical assistant, assistance team. Thank you so much for listening in and have a good day.